We already have a full exhibition timetable for 2011 and we have requests for 2012 as well. My role at the gallery is exhibition coordinator, which involves talking to the artists initially and helping the curators through the setting up process. It's important that the first time exhibitors, artists and curators get the mentoring they need to make their experience at the Crocus Gallery the best it can be. We've had some high quality exhibitions previously, including artwork from overseas. Professionalism is something that we'd like to continue at the Crocus Gallery in the future. For the rest of the year, we have a solo show from local artist Madeline Burt. We also have two solo shows, one in the main gallery and another in the back gallery, from two winners from our previous open exhibitions. We're hoping to develop the curatorial aspect of the gallery by introducing new curative aspects like one-off exhibitions that are on just for one night or during the day in between the exhibition that's already on. The Crocus Gallery opened on the 16th of May 2010. It provides a space for artists and craft makers to show their work to the public. Since we started, around 70 volunteers have helped with the gallery. Most of them have found work or moved on to education. During the last six months, we've developed a strong team of hard-working volunteers and now we have a core of 25 people. As the gallery has developed, it was decided to offer opportunities to volunteers to learn the mechanics of running an art gallery. We discovered that a number of volunteers were interested in curating, so that became the main focus. And so far, seven young aspiring curators have been guided through the process and enabled to organise high quality art exhibitions. I've already seen several of our volunteers grow in confidence and develop new skills. As our team gains further knowledge, skills and experience, it will go from strength to strength. Our main stumbling block is funding. Nottingham City Council provided funding for the, for the rent to get us started. Now we are actively seeking funding and sponsorship to enable us to continue and develop further. It's fantastic to be here in the Crocus Gallery. It's a huge um, improvement to Lenton to have something as fantastic as this, an opportunity for local artists to be able to exhibit their works and local people uh, to be able to enjoy them. And of course, it's next door to the wonderful vegetarian Crocus Cafe, which is a real hit around here. And people come from all over Nottingham to visit it. I'm incredibly proud to be the uh, local MP for Nottingham South and to have this as part of my constituency. Um, so I'm really pleased to be able to congratulate them on reaching their first anniversary. Hello, my name is Marie. Um, I'm a volunteer at the Crocus Gallery. I've been volunteering for six months now, so I've enjoyed invigilating. Uh, that's meeting people and artists um, on a regular basis. Uh, I've enjoyed uh, put, putting up and taking down exhibitions and um, I've also been involved with, with the craft that uh, we make available and sell at the gallery. So there's a whole range of things that, um, that we provide. It's a lot of fun to be here. Um, it's a very warm atmosphere and I really recommend it for people to come and have a look. Hi, um, I'm the volunteer coordinator at the Crocus Gallery, so that means I'm the first point of call for all new volunteers. Um, so I provide the induction process and also introduce new volunteers to the gallery space and all the other rest of the team of the volunteers. We're hoping to provide opportunities for training um, through NCVS, which is the Nottingham Voluntary Service, um, and they're more specific training, but normally we like to encourage a more hands-on approach to training and learning things uh, and new skills. We're looking, to, looking into having specific training opportunities through the NCVS, which is the Nottingham Voluntary Service, but we prefer to have a more hands-on approach to learning new skills within the gallery. We have many different opportunities within the gallery which include 
gaining teching skills, um, which allows people to gain skills and experience in hanging pieces of work, preparing a gallery space for a show. And also we have a fantastic curation team which allows which any volunteers can be a part of and allows them to select themes and intentions for exhibitions and then select artists appropriate for those shows. We also have teams of people working with marketing and filling out funding applications which will in turn help volunteers to pursue their own individual projects. Um, but we're always welcoming new ideas and have had a numerous successful events running alongside exhibitions, one of which includes the Mother's Day event which brought along lots of families and kids from the local area and has led to craft workshops including monthly jewellery workshops. We also have a monthly It's the Crits event which encourages cross-subject, cross-media crit sessions. These have been successful in giving everyone inside and outside the gallery a fantastic opportunity to not only show their work but get constructive feedback in a safe and friendly environment. We also have a fundraising event planned which is a sponsored walk which includes a walking exhibition and this is to promote the gallery outside the gallery space. Within the local area they're holding a London Open Day which encourages local community groups and our gallery to get together with the community. We're always welcome to new volunteers so pop along if you're free.